Hello everyone and welcome to a new DJ tutorial. My name is Chris and today I'm going to show you how to quickly set up your sound in Future DJ Pro. First, you will need to open the preferences window by clicking this button. Here you have the general, audio, control and broadcast settings. Today we're going to focus on the audio setting. Here you can select the audio device for your master output. You can select the, an additional device for previewing and monitoring, as well as being able to configure your output and input routings. If you're working on Mac, the choice is pretty simple, because Mac uses Core Audio. This means that you will choose the device that you want to use, and it will already be at the highest possible quality of sound. As you can see, my latency is very low. This means the sound quality is very very good and on top of that when I press a button for example it will immediately execute the action. The higher the latency is the more time it will take between me pressing the button and the action being executed. If you're using Windows the choice may seem a little more complicated but just as easy. For now I will play a song just to show you how easy it works. So here we already have the sound set. If you're using Windows it may seem a bit overwhelming when being faced with so many choices for your audio device, when in fact it is quite simple. If you have an external audio device as my M Audio Fast Track Ultra, you will need to choose the ASIO as it gives the best quality and lowest latency. If you do not have an external audio device and are primarily relying on your internal sound card, the best choice would be the Wasapi, as you can see here written in brackets. Now that we've seen how to quickly configure our sound, we must remember to always adjust the latency and our devices in order to find the perfect balance between performance, sound quality and the limits of our computer. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos. This is Chris signing out. Have an awesome day.